Hello everybody and welcome back to Ferial. We're here to play another game and I'll be sure to put um, a link to the deck description in the description of this video below. So, let's go! And here we are. We have found ourselves um, a game, so let's see if we get, we get to go um, second, that's fine. And that means Air Elemental on turn one, so that's great. I think we'll uh, absolutely keep this hand. Drakkar Sky Captain on turn one would have been even better, but uh, I think this is fine. So the opponent redraw the hand there, and uh, let's see what we have for the first land. Okay, so it looks like we're facing some sort of rush here. Yeah, that's fine. We'll try to um, block it off, I think. And for that, the air elemental is uh, perfectly fine. We'll hmm, block off on either side here. Hmm. I think that uh, this might actually... I'm thinking about either... Yeah. This is uh, this is actually fine, I think. Or, yeah, I'll put it there. That's that's a good block. And uh, end turn. Now I'm guessing the opponent will go down here, so my next land placement has to be here. The Windborn Champion won't be able to get summoned for a while. It will take me a while to get up to five. Oh, okay, so. This surprised me. I for sure thought that this would be a rush, but hey, I'm not one to argue. I am not one to argue with that. We'll just go here. And... Uh, hmm. Do I play... Yeah, I think I'll actually go this way with uh, the air elemental. And I'll place the Windborn Emissary here. And end turn. So if something comes out here, we have a good chance of combating it. And we have the potential to gather Faria. Wow, so that's uh, actually really neat. Neat play, I think. But... Uh, But I think that we can make this work with uh, one Kalim Sky Guard and the Windborn Emissary. I think so. I don't want to attack with the Air Elemental, obviously. But uh, could, in fact, be nice. Uh, yeah, we'll. We'll go here. We will attack this frog here just to get it off the board. We'll play the Kalim Sky God here. And we'll go down here. And we'll place down another land just to prepare for the Windborn Champion. We'll place it there. And end turn. Now I'm guessing that the uh, frog will take out the Windborn Emissary. And then uh, we'll see what the opponent will do with these eight Feria. Five cards in hand, so a lot of possibilities probably. Okay, so the frog chooses uh, Air Elemental. Gemsilk Fairy gets played. And a Lore Thief. Yeah, okay, that's that's fine. There's a twister. Now I would very much like a Drakkar Sky Captain. I do not have one, of course, but uh, hmm. Yeah, I would like to keep the Windborn Emissary alive here. Very much so. So I think we'll uh, grab some Feria 
and we'll use the Kalim Sky God to get rid of the Lord Thief to perhaps keep the Windborn Emissary alive for a few more turns uh, and uh, we will play another or we will play a Windborn Champion great creature I think costly in land wise but uh, but awesome so we'll place uh, Desert Lair we'll place down the Windborn Champion here I think Yeah, we'll do that. We will do that. That puts some pressure on the opponent's sword. We'll place the Windborn Emissary here, I think. And uh, end turn. So this will perhaps uh, save me the Windborn Emissary here. Uh, and uh, I can uh, perhaps get some fairy on next turn. Okay, another lake tile. Six cards in hand. Possibilities are endless. And let's see what happens. Against the fairy, against the fairy, that's fine. Gabriel Noble. Okay, and now the Prakar Sky Captain comes. Yeah, that's that's fine actually. I think we'll go on the offensive here. I think that's uh, a better choice. We'll attack here for four. We'll place down Desert Tile here. We'll um, use the des Desert Twister here, so we can gain get some more damage done. We'll obviously attack with this. And uh, should we play the Drakkar Sky Captain, or should we indeed save it up for next turn? Could be nice to have the Drakkar Sky Captain, if this offensive does indeed not... Um, if it doesn't suffice would be nice to have some Faria left, uh, but um, but yeah, I think that we'll place the Car Sky Captain down here and uh, end turn. I mean, we can still get out the Kalim Sky God next turn. But obviously these two creatures will get taken out. A shame that the opponent drew into um, an event. Otherwise this uh, wouldn't have the protection to keep it around. Porchester, ah, okay. Now it would be, fan it would be fantastic to draw into uh, The two damage card. Wow, okay. Windborn Emissary, yeah, that's fine too. That is fine, I think. We'll get rid of the Ruby Fish and gain a Fairy in the process. We'll take out the Triton Sanctuary next turn. Hmm. Now I think I'll actually go for a card draw here. I think that's the correct choice. Because I could get the opportunity to take this out uh, if I draw into Flashwind. Interesting. But not quite enough, I think. Yeah, I think we'll uh, play the Windborn Emissary actually because it's out of the reach uh, of the Gamsilk Fairy. So we'll just uh, use this to get rid of the Courchester. We'll bide our time for this turn. We'll play the Windborn Emissary here. We still have a lot of pressure going uh, on the opponent's sword. We have the Flash Wind in our hand so that's nice and uh, I think uh, things are looking good.
and turn, not, nothing more we can do. The opponent has, of course, three Faria with a potential of four, or a potential of, uh, yeah, two more, uh, three more, three more here. Uh, or <laughs> wow, I'm not thinking straight. Yeah, four, four more, of course, two Faria for each of these. So a lot of Faria potentially here. Freedom Fighter. Wow. Okay. Strong play, but can the Windborn Emissary be taken out? Okay, wow. Mirror Phantasm. Soul Drain. Hmm, doesn't help me. Doesn't help me at all. And the Flash Wind does not help me either at this point. Now, I think card draw is uh, the best. A Windborn Champion could have... Uh, a Windborn Champion would be great to play there. Soul Drain would have been great just uh, one turn ago. But uh, still, I suppose it's good to have in hand now as well. Yeah, we'll draw. And a Windborn Champion, which gets buffed by the Drakkar Sky Captain. That is excellent. So let's uh, play that there. We'll move this. Uh, where should we move it? We will, in fact. Yeah, if we move it uh, here. That does mean that our Drakkar Sky Captain gets to live for another turn. And uh, of course, we want that. So uh, let's just end. The opponent could, of course, have another Mirror Phantasm that um, would uh, make short work of the Windborn Champion. Card draw. Triton Sanctuary. Well, Falcon Drive. Okay, so the opponent considered. Well, of course, big thank you to my opponent, and uh, thank you for watching. I'm uh, really enjoying this this flying deck. It's uh, it's neat. Hope to see you again.